I think it's more common than the public would like to hear. It certainly depends a lot on the type of case. Amy Clausing with the Hamilton County Prosecutor's Office is talking about situations where a defendant has a case dismissed because a victim chooses not to go forward with prosecution. She says one factor that often plays a role is whether the defendant is in jail or out on bond. And certainly any time a defendant is out on bond, uh, they have more access to the victim that strikes fear in our victims' hearts when they know that their perpetrator is walking the street. Court records show 23-year-old Dominic Lewis, who is currently wanted for assault, was facing charges of burglary and aggravated burglary until that case was dismissed two months ago after the victim declined to prosecute. What's interesting about this case in particular um, from Blue Ash, the prior case that was dismissed a few months ago, You'll notice that the defendant was released on bail, I think, two months prior to the dismissal. On Monday, Blue Ash police say Lewis used a pistol to beat his co-worker in the laundry room at the Holiday Inn Express and Suites on Creek Road. This surveillance footage lines up with the police report, which says the two men got into an argument. Then Lewis went to get a gun and started to attack the victim. Blue Ash police say they are still trying to find Lewis, who they consider armed and dangerous. According to the police report, the victim suffered a cranial fracture with spinal fluid coming from his ear and went to the hospital with non-life-threatening but serious injuries. I spoke to an employee at the Holiday Inn Express and Suites to ask about the assault. That employee would not comment and I'm still waiting to hear back from management. Anyone with information about Lewis or where he might be should call police. Reporting in Blue Ash, Josh Bazan, WCPL 9 News.